Hey guys, the Ultimate Gamer 19 here, and welcome to the first part of Bigfoot's business. Let's play The Sims 2 Open for Business. Um, since this is a new expansion pack and it is the first part, there will probably be newcomers onto this this channel, so I will have to introduce myself. I'm the Ultimate Gamer 19. I do Sims 2 LPs mostly, and just a occasional Sims 3 there. But no one watches that, so I just put on a quick hiatus. I might continue it later on. But I'm doing mostly Sims 2 now because it is the biggest thing that I'm doing right now, and that's what everyone is here for. So, uh, welcome to my videos, my channel, whatever. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, since this is Bigfoot's missus, we're going to use Bigfoot and move him into a household. I think I want him to live by himself. He doesn't need to live with anybody else, does he? No, he doesn't. Let's get this house over here with the... Actually, no, I don't want that house. I don't know what house we should get. Let's get this house. It's inexpensive. And it's only for one person, so... If it's an ugly house, I probably have to move back out. But this is the Bigfoot family, and he will be having his own business. Our house. It's a very simple house. Alright. Okay. So, ooh. This house is actually not that bad. It's a pretty good house. It's a, just a plain simple house. I like fairly small houses. It's cozy and everything. Let's go ahead and furnish... Furnish. <laughs> Let's furnish our house. With just some simple stuff. Bathroom is fine. Kitchen is fine. I think we need... We already have a place to eat right there. Um buy a cheap couch and a TV set. I don't know where we're gonna put our TV though. <coughs> Sorry, I had a burp. Buy a cheap TV and move this one over here. Okay, um, that's it I guess. We'll have to buy other things later. We need to purchase a community lots. I don't think we can purchase anything right now. If we can't, that sucks. Maybe we have to start our own home business or something. Yeah, I think we need a lot of money to purchase other community lots, because community lots, yeah. Those are expensive stuff there. Okay, we are living in Blue Water Village, and I'm assuming we cannot buy any other community lots. Because they're all so expensive. Ugh. Oh, we can we can buy a little community lot, but those are like really small and not really popular. But it'll grow over time, so I'm gonna probably do with that. Little and local. If you're looking to start a lo little local business, then this place is for you. Just the basics enough to get you started on your entrepreneur journey. Take li little and local to prosperity and beyond. Why not? He's the owner of Little and Local. Um, he will be having a toy shop because he loves children and he wants to have... I mean, he wants like the best for the children. So he's going to have a toy shop. So toys for kids to play with, basically. Which is really nice of him, actually. <laughs> Um, like I said, if you're just coming onto my channel, I'll have to introduce you to some people. Um, this is his friend, Melissa Anderson. They discovered Bigfoot at a... what's it called? Three Lakes? I think it was Three Lakes. They discovered him at Three Lakes and became friends with him and took him home. And then he lived with um, these people, Melissa, Scott, Ariana, Aaron, and I believe... Gabriella. Then he moved out of the house to start his own business, his own life, pretty much. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and go to our community lots. To our little and local place. Okay. Speed up the process. And I'll cut back in when we are at our business and we'll start uh, putting in like toys and all those other things. Not, not a whole lot, but 
just enough to get us started. So I'll see you guys, I'll talk to you guys there. Oh, my finger, okay. Welcome back guys, and Little and Local is actually what it is called. It's really, really little, oh god. I didn't expect it to be this little, but once again, it's little, whatever. So um, over here is the customer loyalty. We don't have no business right now, no customers, employees, no employees. And we don't have any stockings or anything like that. Business information, nothing has started yet. And place objects for sale, basically, you can put objects for sale. So we're going to go ahead and buy some things for our store. It's community sort. Uh, shopping all right so where can we buy shelves we'll just have to use these shelves so we're gonna put some toys on the shelves here um okay oh why did i do that why did i do that This bear here. What else do we need to buy? Just everything for children. He's just gonna run a children's store, I guess. Toy box. <laughs> My different color, actually. Is there a different color? No. Different toy box then. I believe that's it. So this is what we're gonna start off with: three different types of bears, and just chess toy boxes and stuff, and just that's weird thing in the middle. I don't know why. It's random. Let's go ahead and set some things on sale. This bear, this bear, this bear, this bear. Um, it's going to be average, I guess. Let's go ahead and... Uh, is there an open and close sign? I don't know what that is. And there's Sims 1 music, as you can hear. If you probably can't hear, I don't know. Where's it at? Where's the open and close sign? It has to be here around somewhere. Wow, I don't know where it is. I think it's this, yes, this right here. I'm gonna put that right there. I think that's what we need to open the business, is that open and close sign. Wow, this is so, so small. That's what she said. So, uh, that's nasty. I don't like that sign. Be the cashier. And this is his first, I think he does have the badge for it. Where's, the, where's, the, where's that at? It's like really windy outside. Really, really windy outside. He does have the uh, talent badge for register and he's level gold. I think that's good. Level gold. I think that's really, really good. Because it starts off with like bronze or something like that. I have no idea. Bigfoot started with these badges himself because um he's Bigfoot. He has like every set skill and everything once you get him from three legs he has all those things let's go ahead and try to greet him with a high five and dazzle him basic cell try that basic cell you gotta be good with your customers try to dazzle basic sale from him And we're not gonna we're not going on a good start yet. Sales, basic sell for this old chick here, this old hag. Smacker, yeah. <clears throat> Let's dazzle him, I guess.
He got what he wanted, she got what she wanted, and we're dazzling him. He's probably going to go buy that now. <laughs> wow. We are, we are so professional. Okay. There they are, going to line up for their items that they're going to buy. Good job! Congratulations, this is the first simoleon earned by Amara from Little and Local. It has been placed in Am Amara's inventory. Let's play this award with pride for all to see. Awesome. I guess. We're not really still not at a good start yet. Let's try to dazzle her. Try to dazzle her. Like, buy this teddy bear. It's awesome. It'll make you grow more hair. She's like, I, I'm not, I don't want a teddy bear right now. I'm sorry. That sucks. You suck. Oh. May I help you? Com if people are that confused, you have to go help them. Like, what kind of store is this? I wouldn't blame her, though. Been friendly with a lot of people. Okay. Try to get him into buying something. Good. Can we try another basic sell with this chick here? I don't think so. Yeah, she's not interested. Who cares? Um, we're gonna have to buy another one of these. Restock that. Once you're running out of stuff, you need restock. Because the less things you have... You have to spend more money on it. Ugh. Let's go ahead and set this at an expensive rate. Make that expensive. These expensive as well, and we're gonna make them have a hard sell or some sort. Average? Why is it average? I'll keep it as that. I don't know. I'm really clueless when it comes to businesses. Like, I really don't know how to run a business. I don't even know why I'm doing this series, but you learn something from doing this. Customer loyalty stars one. We need two more customer loyalty stars for to reach rank two. We're not really at a good start with Tiffany Zarubin right now. Who cares? See you later. Let's try to um, dazzle her. No, I don't think that's a good thing. What? Why not try it? Why not? She's like, oh, oh! That worked on her. Let's try to dazzle her. Oh gosh. He's got it. Congratulations, your business is now rank 1 and you have gained a point to spend on business perks. Click on the business perks button on the business tracker and choose your new perk. What's the perks? Ooh! We can do a notable reputation. There's connections, perception, cash, wholesale, and motivation. Let's see. Wholesale discount. ka your growing fame as a business owner has motivated your suppliers to offer you a discount on future purchases. Litornu prize. Litornu Nice job. On the recommendation of some of your customers, you've won the literal prize for new business owners. 
You've got a pretty idea of what a happy customer looks like now. You can use assess mood to evaluate how you should have yourself, not a reputation, you're getting to know who you are and they like what they hear, you know you're enjoying this. Let's try the assess mood. Assess mood, is that right? And we need to restock on restock up on some stuff there. And I think we need employees, but we need a lot of money to, you know, hire them. We stock on those things over there. And we stock up on this. If you have any helpful information, go ahead and leave the leave some in the comments section below. If you're good with open for business and you ran like a successful business, please let me know how you did that and give me some tips. It would be greatly appreciated. Cause you know, I'm still kind of a newbie to open for business, so I could use some advice and tips. And there's a good witch on our lot. Making everything sparkly and dazzly. Dazzly, what the heck. I think we're going to go to our home very soon because he's really hungry right now. Let's try to dazzle this girl over here. I know dazzle probably won't work with everybody, but it's worth a try. Ooh, there's a kitty! Erica's, Erica's familiar. It's like a ghost kitty or something. He got her! What's up, girl? What you gonna buy? She's like, I bought the teddy bear you told me to get! Okay. She's kind of creeping me out. She's like, hey, I gotta creep it. Let's go greet her. She's a good witch. Aw, oh, she's leaving. Oh well. Forget you then. Let's go restock up on some of these teddy bears. We're not doing so well. Actually, we're doing quite a good job, actually. I'm doing better than before. I don't know. Assess her mood. What is she like right now? Is she in the mood to be like dazzled again? Is she in the mood to be at a basic cell? I don't know. She seems to be in an average mood, so um, let's go ahead and do a hard cell. Actually, try that out. Nope. 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 Confused people always come first, so let's ask this guy first, because he was here first, I think. And then do her. Okay. Let's try for a heart cell on this girl here. She's not interested. Yeah, she's not interested. Like, stop it! We're not going to do a hard sell. That's just too tempting. Well, not too tempting, but aggravating for some people. Um, I don't know what to do. I seriously don't know what to do. Dazzle them. Basic sell. Let's try basic sell now. Okay, he's got the basic sell done. Try basic sell on her, right? Dazzle her? I don't know. <sighs> oh god, there's so many people! Can we leave while there's people here? I'm assuming we can do that. Oh my god, look at him! He's throwing a tantrum. He's throwing a tantrum. Okay, let's go ahead and go home. Uh, that's enough for the business for to enough of the business for today. But get out, guys! I'm sorry. Go ring up the customers before you leave. Come here. Ring up the customers. Okay, good. 
can go home now. Can we go home? Walk to the left, walk to the left. I'm, I'm blind. So, uh, we're going to go ahead and go home, and I'll talk to you guys in there. Okay, welcome back, guys. The thing I don't like about The Sims 2 is that when you leave a when you leave your home to go to a community lot the same time you leave is the same time when you come back and I know some of you have heard me say that before but it's really 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 stupid and I hate that but um, we're gonna get like cozy with our house I guess like get used to our house break it in a little bit with some uh, breakfast actually He's a professional cook, so he should not be able to set our house on fire. But he was, like, with the Andersons, so he may have caught off some of that fire stuff from them. Mr. Humble is here. And he, had, he got us a present. Um, for those of you wondering, Mr. Humble comes with free time. He'll come to your house all the time, I, I think. That didn't really fill you up that well. Eat another pancake. He's so lonely in this house. He's like throwing more tantrums. Because he's really tired, so yeah, I wouldn't blame him. I'm gonna have him sleep. Let's try to buy a different bed. Because that bed doesn't really look that comfortable. This one's a little too expensive. We need to use spend our money wisely on things. Because we do have a business. We don't want to be like clo shut down before we even get to start it. So use your money wisely. Also guys, this is a cheat free let's play series, so I will not be using any cheats because it kind of ruins the fun of the game. Um, so please do not put like comments saying like, you can use mother load. I know everything about the cheats and I will not use the cheats, it's just a cheat free let's play. And people are here. He wants to scare them. Don't do not do that. Um... Go greet everyone, I guess. And then go to sleep. Oh, he's gonna sleep right now. He's that tired. Invite everybody. You're such. You're so rude. Oh my gosh. What's wrong with you? Bigfoot is mean. Oh. I'm surprised she still wants to go in the house after what he did to her right there. We're going to go ahead and end the part here. Um, if you guys like the video, go ahead and click the like button below. Thumbs it up. Um, if you want to continue watching this series or if you want to see any of my other series, um, go ahead and click the subscribe button uh, if if you haven't already. So thanks for watching, guys, and see you guys in episode two. I say guys a lot. I'll see you in episode two, where we will probably pick up on more of the business and get used to this house more. So see you guys in episode two.